Hey, this is Dr. Torchio, Clinic Director at Pangea Chiropractic. And today we're going to be talking about four simple stretches that you can be doing if you're suffering from neck pain. And you can share this with other people or friends or family that you know, those people suffering from neck pain. Four simple stretches, they literally can change your life if you implement these and you do these every single day. I know you'll get some great results. Now, here's Dr. Brent. Uh, he's going to be our model for us today. We're going to go over these stretches. The first one that we're going to go over is called a chin jut. Now, uh, Dr. Brent, if you could show us the, the chin jut, I'm going to explain to you exactly what we're looking for. Go ahead, Doc. So what he's doing is he's, he, he's emulating that if he's sliding his chin across the table, forward and then all the way in, and he's sliding forward and then all the way in to almost give himself a double chin. Now when you're doing this stretch, it's not an exercise. It's a motion glide, watch my hands as he does it. It's a motion glide of the skull riding on top of the spine. That motion that Dr. Brent is doing and I want you to do will help get some, uh, some biomechanics and once again, motion back in the top part of the neck. Sometimes you'll even hear those bones click a little bit as you go through that motion, okay? That is one of the best stretches you can do for neck pain. Second stretch that we can do for neck pain uh, Dr. Brent, we're going to do a lateral stretch. You bend your head to one side, and Dr. Brent, take your hand up the same side, and he's gently guiding and pulling that direction. And we're stretching all of the muscles on the opposite and lateral or outside part of the neck. You'll feel that all the way down to your shoulder. Dr. Brent, let's switch. Then he switches and goes the other way, and he's going to feel that stretch all the way down from the back of his ear, down toward the shoulder. Do that in both directions. Don't push it, but do it in both directions. Don't just do it to the one side. If it hurts, don't keep doing it. Just back off and lightly do that stretch. From there, we're gonna go to the, the side and then we're gonna look down toward your knee. Dr. Brent, same arm, he's gonna pull. This is gonna hit another angle of some other muscles more towards the back of the spine. Remember, we're stretching the opposite direction that we're going. Dr. Brent, then we're gonna come back the other direction. Bending over and then angling down. We're getting different muscle groups on the back side of the neck. These are the muscles that get aggravated when you're on your computer and you're texting all day. Good? All right. From there, we're gonna go into a front neck stretch. So for this one, you have to have your mouth open. So Dr. Brent's gonna keep his mouth open. He's gonna angle over and then he's gonna look back. And when he gets back, he's gonna close his mouth and he's gonna feel a big stretch on the front part of the neck all the way down to the collarbone. This is called the SCM muscle, okay? That muscle needs stretch when we get punched forward. So Dr. Brent, let's go the other direction. Open mouth, back, and lean. No, stop. Open your mouth, okay, we're gonna go this way, and then we're gonna go back, and now he's gonna close his mouth, and when he closes his mouth, he's gonna get that big stretch on the front part of the neck. Lastly, this is one that you can do. If you're in a lot of pain, I don't recommend this one, but for general stretches, you're gonna lie with your head hanging off the bed for about two to three minutes maximum. Dr. Brayton, you wanna show him? So imagine we're lying on your bed at home, He's gonna to come to the corner of the bed and he's gonna hang his head off. Now, what you can see is happening is that his neck is coming into a curvature, which is the natural curve of the neck. And what we're doing is we're going from here on the computer and cell phone all day to opening up and extending our head back. This is one of the only ways that you can really get that natural curve back into the neck. These four simple stretches are extremely powerful and I highly recommend you doing these even if you don't have neck pain. If you do have neck pain, give us a call, come on in so that we can do a thorough assessment and help you on your journey.